Hello friends, today we are going to see how to delete a linked list totally. So let's see. So this is the linked list and we have to delete all nodes of this linked list and free the memory after deleting the nodes. So let's see the code for that. See, delete is the function and then we are passing the head of the linked list to that function. This is the head of the linked list which we are passing to the function. Now, let's start executing the statements. See, pointer p and pointer store are declared to hold some addresses further in the program. So, see, p is equal to head. Means, p will point to head at first and after that we will trace the whole linked list by using the pointer p. So, now, see, let's go in while loop to trace the linked list. So, while p is not equal to null, means till p becomes null, this loop will keep executing. So, see, store equal to p points next. So, what is this? What is this store variable doing here? So, now we are going to delete every node when we reach that node. And currently, we are at the head node. And now we are going to delete this node. Okay. But if we delete this node, then we will lose all the further addresses. See, if we delete this node, then we will lose this link. This link will also be deleted along with this node. Because inside this node, the address of the next node is stored. Okay. So what this node holds? This node holds the data and the address of the next node. This is the address of the next node. Okay. So, if we delete this node, then the address of the next node is also lost. So, that is why before we delete this node, <coughs> so see, before we delete this node, you have to store the address of this next node. Okay. So, before deleting this node, we will store the address of this next node. So, now see here store equal to p points next means address of the next node means address of b will be stored in store variable. Okay. And after that, we will delete that node with using function free. Okay. We will delete that node by using function free. So, function free deallocates the memory, okay, the function free frees the memory, okay, deallocates means it frees the memory, it makes the memory free and deletes the node at that location, okay. So, see, we will free this node, means we will delete this node and after that, p will point to store, means P will go to the next node that is store. Okay. So now P is at B. Okay. Node B means at the store pointer. So now again inside the next while loop, see now the current node is P and now for deleting P, store will hold the address of next node. Okay. And after store holds the address of next node, we will delete p, right? And again, the third statement, this will make p point to store. Again, in the next iteration of while loop, c. Before we delete this node, c, store will hold the address of next node. After store holds the address of next node, we will delete p and then p will go ahead and hold the address of the node store. Okay. C. And finally, for deleting D, store will hold the address of next node, but that is null. And after store holds the address of next node, we will delete P and P will become equal to store after deleting D. And now P is equal to null. So, at that iteration, 
P will become equal to null. Okay, so that means this while condition fails. So we will come out of the while loop, and in this way we will delete the whole linked list, and we will free the memory. Means we will deallocate the memory of the nodes. Hey friends, please subscribe to my channel as I post algorithm videos every day. And if you want a video on any particular topic, then please mention in the comment below. Thank you.